Who bit Beyonce? It's the question on many minds, and Chrissy Teigen says she knows who the culprit is. Plus, many are calling the latest Heineken ad racist. We have those stories and more for this week's Top Trends. Hey everyone, I'm Benny Adams and welcome to your Top Trends. It's where I give you some of the biggest stories that happened throughout the week. We're starting off with Jason Aldean. He's dedicating his new album, Rearview Town, to the victims of the 1 October mass shooting. According to the country music blog, The Boots, the album doesn't include any music about the tragedy since it was mostly recorded before that night, but he said he wanted to dedicate the album on a personal note for himself. Aldean also says he is considering coming back to Las Vegas to finish his Route 91 set. And the former stylist who accused Ryan Seacrest of sexual harassment has filed a police report in Los Angeles. According to The Hollywood Reporter, Susie Hardy claimed Seacrest engaged in several inappropriate acts with her, including pushing her head towards his crotch, grinding against her, and slapping her buttocks so hard he left a mark. She says the behavior went on between 2007 and 2012 while she was Seacrest's personal stylist. Ryan Seacrest's lawyers responded to the accusations by saying in part after an independent legal investigation did not support her claims, Ms. Hardy went to the press attacking the legitimacy of the investigation. He went on to say Ms. Hardy now claims to have spoken to the authorities. We will continue to cooperate and we will remain confident that Mr. Seacrest will once again be cleared of any wrongdoing. And many are accusing Heineken of wrongdoing. They are calling the latest ad racist. Now this is the ad in question. Let's take a look. It features a bartender sliding a bottle of Heineken Light to a woman. The bottle travels past several black people, arriving at the lighter-skinned woman. The clip, which came under fire on social media, ends with the tagline, sometimes lighter is better. Chance the Rapper called it terribly racist on Twitter and other users agreed with him. Heineken responded by pulling the ad from TV and internet. A spokesperson for Heineken USA said, while we feel the ad is referencing our Heineken light beer and that light beer is better than other high calorie options, we missed the mark. We are taking the feedback to heart and we'll use this to influence future campaigns. It is the question sweeping social media, who bit Beyonce? The mystery started when Tiffany Haddish said during a GQ interview that an unnamed actress bit Queen Bey on the face. Haddish says she met Beyonce at a party where the bike gate went down, but she is staying quiet about the incident. Now in her model, Chrissy Teigen, she got in on the action and started doing some investigating herself and she eventually found out who the culprit was. Here's what she had to say while talking to Kathy Lee and Hoda. There really was a bite. That there, you, there was a bite. You can confirm her. the bite. Yes. Okay. But I love, the problem is I love everybody involved. <gasps> so I'm like, zip. Yeah, so it seems like Chrissy Teigen's lips are sealed. Only time will tell if the accused face spider will be revealed. And those are your top trends for this week. You can find more trending stories right here on our website, news3lv.com. That's all the time we have for today. I'm Benny Adams, and I will see you guys next week.